Hello everyone. Today's world of service-oriented development usually requires us to connect our applications to some sort of RESTful API. Everything seems to be moving towards a service model. Every application being distributed across the entire enterprise and accessible via the internet. But this can sometimes be a problem when an API doesn't yet exist or is slow or unreliable. Or sometimes you might need to eliminate external dependencies or need the API to work offline. In today's pro tip, I'm going to discuss an open source project that allows you to mock a service with very little work on your end. With JSON Server, you can get a full fake REST API with zero coding in less than 30 seconds. You can find JSON Server on GitHub, and the steps to get up and running are quite simple. First, we'll install JSON Server using npm in our project directory. Next, we'll create a db.json file with some data. For this example, our test project is a social app, and we want to mock users' posts. Lastly, we need to start our server. Now, if you navigate your browser to the mock endpoint and pass in the post's ID, you'll get back data for that post. Reading the data isn't the only thing you can do, though. If you make post, put, patch, or delete requests, changes will be automatically and safely saved to your db.json file. This library is very powerful because of all of its advanced settings. You can use JSON Server to serve HTML, JS, and CSS files, use remote schemas, use JavaScript to generate random data programmatically, and much, much more. You can even host your db.json file in a GitHub repo, and using the My JSON Server service allow your team to connect to it as well. Whether you need to mock a service for your application due to external dependencies, or perhaps need something to help with a quick POC, JSON Server is definitely a needed tool in your developer toolbox. Drop into the comments, let us know your favorite JSON Server feature, or leave us some ideas for future pro tips. Thanks for watching.